who wishes to see the pirate Eloise? Please, your scary ship. I have the treasure you requested in exchange for the prisoner. Very well. You may enter. Bill is my best friend. But no funny business. He's an actor and wears red socks, and I absolutely adore him. You have your treasure? Release the prisoner. That, I see. What? This? Ah, ah. God, villain. serving breakfast or working parties. He takes acting lessons with Lee Strasberg. You want to help me set up for a party later in the terrace room? Say, 4 o'clock? Okay. Of course, I'll have to check my schedule. Bill and I make rather a good catering team. Sometimes we pretend that we're king and queen, preparing a little soiree for our closest friends. Did we remember to invite the Duke and Duchess of Rigatoni? Yes, but I'm afraid they can't make it. Their kingdom is being plagued by dragons at the moment. Nasty time to travel. <coughs> In the meadow we can build a snowman. And pretend that he is Parson Brown. He'll say, are you married? We'll say, no, man. But you can do the job when you're in town Later on, we'll conspire As we dream by the fire To face unafraid the plans that we made Walking in, in a winter, winter wonderland. wonderland So, how's that Christmas list coming? Still one or two items short. How many you got so far? Seventy-three. What? I think it's nice to give Santa lots of options. Later on, we'll conspire as we dream by the fire. Am I boring you? To face unafraid the plans that we made. Walking in a winter wonderland. Walking in a winter wonderland. All right, back to work. I'll get the salad dressings, and you do the dessert forks. Aye, aye, sir. Something in shot room? What is the matter with you? Hello, Bill. Once, a long time ago. I didn't know you'd returned home. Ah, uh, Bill. The third, Rachel's fiance. Oh, I see. Well, congratulations. I hate to interrupt your happy little reunion, but we do have a wedding to plan. Now then, right? You've been talking to your friend Bill, huh? Sorry, I'll have these out of your way in a second. Bill. Is he really what you wanted? Or is he what your father wanted for you? Just tell me it's for real, and I swear I'll never say hey, another- Nice machine. Hey, Bob, nice to see you again. Bill. Right. Hey, listen, would you uh, be a sport and fill this up for us? I got some champagne that needs chilling. You don't mind, do you? No, of course not. Great. It's my job, right? is right and whose daughter eloped with the milkman my favorite is patrice he has why don't you ask bill himself ask me what the child wants to know about you and miss rachel nothing to tell that was four years ago so it was a long time ago kiddo Bill, we all did. 
So I was thinking it would be absolutely the perfect time for you to teach me that new song on the piano. That's what you were thinking, huh? Please, I want to be able to play it for my mother when she gets home as a Christmas present. Okay. What time? 3.45. And don't be late. I'm back to the chorus. Hark the herald angels sing glory. What are you doing here? I guess the others haven't shown up yet. That's okay. You can wait here with us. Um, I have to run then get something. Why don't you sit here, Renda? Sing with Bill. It'll be just like old times. I, uh, told Eloise about the little shows we used to put on. Hmm. Memories linger, some happy, some sad. But when I'm beside you, the sad's not so bad. This is always one of your favorites, was it? Wherever we go, whatever we do, we're gonna go through it together. We may not go far, but sure as a star, wherever we are, it's together. Wherever I go, I know she goes wherever i go i know he goes no fits no fights no feuds and no egos amigos together truth it can do things all out or all in and whether it's win place or show with you for me and me for you we'll model through whatever we do together wherever what in not a cabaret and actually requires something that passes for talent who oh, you dare speak to him like bill happens to be a very close friend of mine whom i asked to stay because you were an hour late to our meeting I, I, I beg your pardon, but Not I... Not mine. His. Thank you to remember that it's people like Bill who are the very heart and soul of this hotel. Thank you for a wonderful time. It for me. Merry Christmas, everybody. Yeah. Who's been to see Vincent? How dare he trim the hair of such a fearsome pirate? Very funny. I don't think I didn't squawk him the kneecaps for it either. Hey, have a good one, Bill. Thanks, Kevin. Have a good what? Vacation. I'm taking the train up to Vermont for a couple days. What now? Not after all I went through to get your Christmas present. Here, see? Two tickets to tonight's performance of Gypsy. I figured you could take Rachel with you. Look, Eloise, I know what you're trying to do here. I'm not trying to do anything. Jeez, can a person want to see two friends go out and have a good time? Besides, she'll need some cheering up. Brooks has to go out of town on business. And knowing how you love the theater and she loves Gypsy, the whole thing is rather perfect. Which is why you can't go to Vermont. You absolutely can't. Thank you, Eloise. It's a lovely gift. Meaning, I'll ask her. And if she says yes? I guess I could take a later train.
My sister, please forgive me for not coming sooner. My country's been in great turmoil since Edgar's passing. He was deeply loved by our people. Now, it has taken me many months, but I have finally persuaded the government to release part of Edgar's fortune. Not all of it, but enough to ensure that you will be well taken care of for the rest of your days. It is my home, after all. And always will be. Thank you. Instead of a fine, upstanding citizen like Brooks? Well. A herald angel sing. Ever had a better Christmas present? Well done, my love.